Hello, Bungarians. Welcome to Beauty Dive's Thursday. Today, it is our final session of the digital outreach endeavor under the school's LLP Gem at ZPS. On Tuesday, you learn about eco labor products and the benefits of choosing them. Today, we will learn more about reducing food usage as part of this series on responsible consumption and production. Before we start the lesson today, Let's take a look at the top 3 winners from each level for the Kabu quiz. They are the winners from last week's quiz on going one next. Hello, Tans, reporting live for so CMI News. And today we're going to be covering the topics of food waste. So, according to the studies, the amount of avoidable food waste in every household is equivalent to about throwing away 2.5 kg of rice every week. So, today I'm going to be asking people about their tips on how to prevent food waste. Now, you see this person's over here? He's ordered so much food and then he's wasted. Hey, why take my seat? I'm still eating it. And now we have our first interview. Hello, Auntie. Oh, hello. So, Aunties, how do you and your families prevent the food waste? Ah, uh, very simple. I just cook just enough for me and my son, huh? Eh? Well, it smells very good, Auntie. Oh, thank you. I got one trigger is that uh, whatever the expire first day, just use first. Uh. <laughs> hey, Auntie, where's my where's my boy? Uh? What time already? So late, I haven't come yet. Hey, you want to see photo of my son, Nana? Uh? Ah, uh, okay. Mm. Oh, handsome man! Auntie, he's very handsome. Auntie, I'm still single. Oh, uh, yeah, better not be single for too long, you know. Otherwise, I usually go expiry day, you know? Going live in 3, 2, 1. So, sir, how do you prevent the food waste? So, for me, right, I need to keep my shape. So, the way I prevent food waste is this. <coughs> As you can see, I have a very strict diet. So, I need to make sure I store everything well so it doesn't go bad. Uh, uh, it looks very healthy and delicious, huh? Oh, hey, here! Have one! I have extra, don't worry! Uh, I know the camera always adds 10 kilos. Um, Becky, maybe you, you can take? Give it back to me. Go, go. This one, cheat day. So as a broke uni student, right, it is paramount that one plans one's purchases. It's also ideal to optimise on leftovers. Well, this is very organised, huh? Well, yes, I am. I also collected a selection of recipes that make use of leftover ingredients. Wanna see? to the end of our new segments on food waste. I hope that you use some of the tips over here that has been shared, yeah? So all this is going to help towards reducing all our food waste and our carbon emissions. Yeah, this is what I said, right, Becky? This is what I said. I said carbon emissions. Carbon emissions, I pronounced it correct, okay? So you don't think you're so clever, you know, you're just like the food you're a waste. You're such a waste, okay, Becky? Waste my time. See, even the car is on you. Okay, thanks, bye. Now that we watched the video, I have learned more about the useful tips to reduce food waste. We hope that we obtain new knowledge and useful information for weeks as we journey together. We 
thank you for joining us on this green adventure. So this is the final session in the digital outreach endeavor series. Remember that this is certainly not the end to learning about the environment. Please go forward and apply what you have learned. Yes, join us to be a defender of the environment. If you have enjoyed learning about the environment with us, we welcome you to join the CCA Peak Club so that we can continue to share the knowledge with the community. Fellow Zongan, we wish you all the best in all that you do for environmental education. Till we meet again, goodbye! Bye.